Welcome to Kaya's Garage. Thank you guys for tuning in. If you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get into today's video. So today, as you guys know, we'll be doing a debadging of the symbols and the tail light. So all you need for today is a bottle of Goo Gone. You can get that from Walmart, five bucks, and an old debit card or gift card like I have right here. And let's get into it. All right, so for this debadging, what we're gonna do is take off these Dodge letters. I just don't like how they're chrome and the rest of the car is like a gunmetal gray kind of thing. So I'm gonna just delete that. Let's go ahead and pop the trunk. And I like to pop the trunk when I do this so that once I apply the glue gun and spray it on here, it'll kind of stay opposed to it being just like vertical and it'll just drip down. And it'll kind of just stay once it's kind of level how this one is. So. We'll just leave it like this. We'll grab our goo gone right here. You get this at Walmart, it's like $5, it's real cheap. And you'll just kind of spray it on here. And then you just kind of let it soak on there. You don't have to wait long, but usually I wait about a good minute or two. And after that, it'll go ahead and just kind of get all the adhesive behind it loosened up. And then you just take a basic scraper or like me a little old gift card or something and just scrape on it. So just let that sit for a second and then we'll go in there and get it off. So I'll see you guys in about two minutes. All right, so it's been about two minutes. It really doesn't take that long, but I just like to get it extra time just in case. So what we're gonna do now is just kind of just close the trunk. And you just take your old debit card or gift card or whatever, and just go on the side of the letter, just like this, and just get behind it. Wiggle in there and push, and they should just come off. Just get behind it, wiggle around a little bit, change your angles, and just slide right off. I just like the clean look of it when there's no letters and just the scat pack emblem down there, so that's the look I'm going for. So now that all the letters are off, just to give a quick look at it, there still is a little bit of the um, adhesive on there. So all you wanna do is just kind of scrape at it a little bit and most of it'll come off. And then scrape, 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 wipe it off, see what's left and do some more scraping until it's all gone. So I'm gonna go ahead and scrape this off and I'll see you guys in a second. So also from the auction when they put the um, I don't know what you call it, I guess the film covers because the sunroof, the windows in the front all were open. So they covered it up with like the blue little wrapping stuff and then left some adhesive over. So the goo gone can get stuff like that off the car too. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray that and get that off of it. As you can see, the goo gone worked pretty good because all the adhesive is gone. Let's go and check out the trunk now. All right guys, so there you go, the end result. I just think it looks better without the chrome letters on there. It just goes better for the look I'm looking for. And if you guys want to do something similar, man, just with a badge delete in your car, five bucks. And an old debit card is all you need. You can get it done, man. So thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys in the next one.